what's up guys welcome back to the channel today we got the 2.5 inch to gin from quad mula here we got the custom painted frame I'm going to be using the speedy B the speedy B 35 amp stack this is a nice 20 by 20 stack. I could use an all-in-one, try to make it a little bit lighter, but... So we got the DJI 03 air unit we're going to be putting in here. That way we don't have to worry about no action cam. Adding weight and all that. So first things first. We're going to be using the uh, 03 mount screws. We'll get this thing secured in there. But first, we got to put this camera cable on there and then we can get it secured in place. We're probably going to need this. It's going to go towards the front like so. So we'll put this, we'll put this aside. So we got our ESC cable hooked up. We're going to mount this thing backwards. Now Quad Mula does send, where is it? I just seen it. They do send some of this tubing here to put over your stack screws so I think that's what I'm going to do right now I guess for like a dampening just kind of holding it over the screw and cutting it to length iron heating up while putting this thing together I just want to make sure these are tight pretty cool how you can access the stack screws from the bottom still they left this little opening that's pretty cool All right, let's flip it around. All right, switch to this bigger tip here. So we can get this XT30 lead tinned up. Just want to put a little more solder on these here. 
because I don't know what comes on there from the factory, solder-wise. So I'll add some of my own solder that I know works. Okay, let's go for the negative. Let me just turn this a little bit. My old three camera is getting tossed around like it's fucking nothing. That's the main component. Okay, let's see. Let's see how this one goes. truck So I decided to go with the Zing 1404 5500 KV. Um, these these motors came off of uh, my iFlight pusher, and uh, you know it's a it's a good drone. I just I rather do some freestyling. I don't really do any cinematic type things, so I just tossed them on here for now. I did look online to see if. if you know, anybody had these in stock, these 1404s, but I couldn't find any. So I don't know if these are just so old that, you know, nobody stocks them or what, but I'm going to try these. I wish I could, I wish I had some uh, full bladed props, but I couldn't find any of those as well. I did hit up Quad Mula, see if they could send me some. But I'm just waiting for them to respond. So I'm gonna try. I'm gonna try flying this thing with the 550 tattoo battery. I got a couple of these 6s. I'm not really concerned about the weight on this thing, but we'll go ahead and wait for you guys just so I can show you. Just so you guys have a rough idea what this thing weighs. Without a battery strap. We're looking at 256 grams. I'll throw a battery strap on there just for the hell of it. Damn, 260. So we could we could make the O3 a little lighter and probably get an all-in-one in there, but 
that wasn't my main concern. My main concern was making this thing fly, you know, really good. Let's get this thing bound up. Gotta clean these lenses. Gotta clean these eyepieces. All right, we got this thing bound up. Let's go take it outside for its maiden flight. I am running 6s. Running 6s on these Zing 5500 1404 motors. Let's see how this goes. I think um, the math came out to uh, the motor output limit is 32%. So these ESCs won't blow when I hook up 6S. So let's bring it outside and uh, do a test flight. It's not the greatest weather out here. But it's good enough to get on maiden flight anyways. So we're rocking the Dijin Quad Mula. 2.5 inch we got the 556s battery let's see how it goes is she gonna fly or is she gonna explode let's check it out Let me just throw the goggles on and see how she flies real quick. I got the tune on there from uh, Chris Miller. I appreciate you, bro. It actually flies wicked good. Just a little heavy. Wicked stable though, no shakes. Right up over my head. Yeah, the O3 is working pretty good. Flies really good actually with this tune on there. Can't crash because it's wet out here. It's the last thing I need. I don't know, this thing flies wicked good though. I gotta get some smaller uh, 6S batteries. Motors aren't even warm at all. Yeah. Chris, I appreciate you, bruh. This tune is dope. And I uh, look forward to getting some smaller 6S batteries, see if we can't get this thing ripping. It's a little heavy right now, so. Till the next one, guys. Thanks for watching.